All right, y'all. Good morning, afternoon, or evening, whenever you're tuning in. I'm great. See, I went blank. I'm grateful to have you here, but I'm gonna keep it rolling because we got Elvis Presley, the King of Music, not the King. We know Jesus Christ, right hand of the throne of God. That's the King. And if you don't agree with that on this channel, you probably aren't gonna like my videos. But we gotta talk about it. Gospel music. We're diving deep into the Elvis catalog. I just did How Great Thou Art, uh, Peace in the Valley. I've done that. I also did uh, You'll Never Walk Alone. I'm loving these right here. I, just another layer of excellence that Elvis brought to the table. Today we got Oh Happy Day from 1970 live performance. It's a 1755 hymn by Philip Doddridge, which is also based on uh, the scripture, Acts 8 verse 35, which talks about Philip and sharing the good news of Jesus. So uh, it began as a hymn written in the mid 18th century, Oh Happy Day, that fixed my choice um, and there was it was then later recorded in 1969 by Edwin Hawkins singers um, and became an international hit reaching number four on the US singles chart number one in France Germany and the Netherlands and number two on the Canadian singles chart UK singles chart and Irish singles chart I love sharing these facts with y'all just for those just to add a little layer of whatever you call that uh, just information and since it has become a gospel music standard so I love it I've definitely heard oh happy day but I can't wait to hear Elvis's spin on it. It's real quick, so don't blink. Subscribe, like, notification bell before you roll out so you stay up to date on all my Elvis videos. Outside of that, set the rant over here. Let's get it popping. Oh, they just started to roll the camera. We stopped singing, man. Oh, have a day. Oh, it's like rehearsal. Okay, it's different. Oh, have a day. When Jesus was. He washed, mm. he washed my sins away. Amen. And he didn't have to. Ooh, every day. Get on now. Ooh. He taught me how to Go, Elvis. Watch it. My Jesus and your Jesus. Come on now. Oh, when he was, he washed my sins away. Oh, I'm scared of that. Oh yeah. I don't know. I don't know. That's raw Elvis right there. That was that was too quick. That was too quick because Elvis was really getting into it, really showing his his heart and soul and how real it is. It's not just music to Elvis. Like he when, when he's doing the gospel, when he that's life right there. That's what you base your life on. That build your house on a on a rock. Don't build it on sand. That's the firmest foundation right there is in this good book, this Bible right here. Basic instructions before leaving earth. I highly encourage you. Matter of fact, I know it's it's you better get into it. You better get into it before you go. But just talk about oh happy day. Every day we wake up. Every, like we're sinners, you know what I'm saying? Jesus was perfect and he didn't have to die for us, but D Jesus does not discriminate. God doesn't discriminate. He created all things and Jesus said, you know what? I'm gonna die for all of y'all that, uh, when we found evil in, in the Garden of Eden, you know what I'm saying? And, Adam, Eve, Satan lurking in serpent form, and we found what, what sin is, you know what I'm saying? And Jesus said, you know what? Forgive them. They don't know any better. I'm going to take on the world. There's one race, human race. And Jesus said, I, I want everybody to love. I want everybody to give. And, and that's how you find peace, looking to Jesus, turning your head towards Jesus. Every day that you get to 
wake up that God blesses you with another day, you better thank the Lord because you, you you could not be here. You know what I'm saying? You could be lost in your sin. You could be stranded. And if there wasn't Jesus, if there wasn't God, there, there'd be no truth. There'd be no purpose. And that's how a lot of people in 2022 are living. They're chasing perversion, chasing these false headlines and narratives and, and living for worldly things. Jesus overcame the world. So you better turn towards him and you better find that, that grace because all this stuff that you're pursuing day in and day out, I'm talking to somebody out there that I'm... I don't mean to, to bring out guilt in you, but hey, I've had to face my sins. I have to face my sins all the time. You, you're gonna have to face it at some, some time. You might as well face it while you're here instead of judgment day, because if you face it at judgment day and you haven't accepted Jesus as Lord, as your savior, it's gonna be hot. It's gonna get real hot. You go in there with your little your little water pistols, it ain't gonna cool it down. All that that perversion and selfish tendencies and greed, that ain't gonna stop you. <laughs> that ain't gonna help you when it when it comes time to face that judgment. So you better accept the Lord Jesus Christ as your savior. That's not cult talk, that's wanting the best for you talk. That's that's knowing that Jesus waxed on, waxed off our sins so you can be forgiven. So all the past things that you've been through everything that you have been through. You know what I'm saying? It can all be forgiven when you accept Jesus as Lord. Get baptized in his name, accept him as Lord, that he died for our sins, and life's gonna be good. It's gonna be oh happy day every day. God called Elvis home. He said, you know what, you were, you were, I know Elvis had his problems, we all have our problems, none of us are perfect. Let, let, let you be the last to throw a stone. God called him home. He was touched by God and God said, you know what? I need you up here. And, and those of us that, that have accepted Jesus as Savior, as Lord, as the King, the one and only King on the throne, we're going to be partying with Elvis someday. I truly believe that. So I'm wishing the best for y'all. I'm praying for you. If you're confused, if anything like that, you can always reach out via email. I'd love to, to talk about it. Again, I'm not a pastor. I just share my testimony and the saving grace that, that God has, has allowed me to discuss and allowed me to, to pursue him each day. So I love y'all, man. Stop going where the crowds go because just usually popular opinion was popular in the world and, and being publicized. That's it, it's not it's usually not where the truth lies. You know what I'm saying? Just because somebody says it's, it's truth doesn't make it fact. There's one truth. That's Jesus. That's my guiding light to my feet. That's my lamp. And where, where I'm going to always share the good news because what else am I going to talk about? What else am I going to talk about? Other What is cooler and more astounding and amazing than a man taking on the world, self, selflessly taking on that cross and enduring all of that? Barabbas walked free. You know what I'm saying? They freed the, the murderer and they murdered Jesus. But then God said, you know what? I got something for you. I'm going to raise him from the grave. He overcame the world. So you can overcome your sin by facing, facing and, and accepting Jesus as Lord. I love y'all, man. I just want the best for you. So subscribe, like, notification bell. If you're new, so you stamped it in on all my Elvis reactions. Rest in peace to the to the king of music, the man Elvis Presley. Um, thank y'all for tuning in. I'm praying for you. If you need to reach out, all my links are on uh, on the screen in the description. If you want to support the channel, join Patreon, become a member of the YouTube. By no means do you have to. I just love checking out these classics with y'all for, for my first time hearing these covers and, and all the other stuff y'all put me on to. So I appreciate y'all. Godspeed. I'm gone. If you made it to this point in the video, I appreciate you watching first and foremost. And by now, I'm sure if you've been watching my channel for a while, you've seen my trading video, you see what I do outside of YouTube videos, because you know YouTube doesn't cut the check like that. So I've been trading for the past six years, a little bit over six years now. So if you're interested in what I do, you want to learn a new skill set, work is hard, or everything is all good, beautiful, and, and blessings your way, it, it's, it's all good. I'm glad for you, but you need to learn a skill set that allows your money to work for you. So check the pinned comment down below, check out that video, and uh, we can continue to move on forward. If not, man, just keep on watching my videos, keep on putting good out into the world and trying to get better every single day. I love y'all, man. If you need to get a hold of me, email dgibbyfit at gmail.com. That's the best way to get in contact, whether it's in regards to trading, my YouTube, you just need some help along life, you need a piece of motivation, a swift kick in the butt, I'm here to help, man. So I appreciate y'all. I'm gone.